guys, let's go ahead and compare these down comforters. Uh, we're going to compare this What's Bedding uh, gray count down comforter to this uh, K-Syntex um, bedding. And uh, first thing that I want to tell you is that this one is in gray color. Uh, it does have the tabs for you to be able to um, put in a duvet and tie it to your duvet. As well as the K-Syntex, it too will go ahead and have your tabs for you to go ahead and put in duvet. Uh, this one is going to be much thicker than this one. Uh, this one is extremely thin. Uh, I can actually feel kind of how thin that is uh, just because of it just doesn't have a lot of cushion. So it's very, very lightweight, um, extremely lightweight. As compared to this case syntax, you can see just how much fluffier that is um, just by touching it and kind of moving it around. Uh, this one will have feathers in it. Is a, it's a goose down um, with feathers as compared to this one, which is all 100% down. There are no feathers in this. It is all down. So I can feel kind of the feathers in this, kind of those little spiky feelings uh, as compared to this one. It's extremely soft and um very, very cushiony. Um, the other thing that I can tell you is that this one is extremely, extremely soft as far as the outer material. If I didn't want to put this in a duvet, I could actually put this across my body and it would feel fantastic. Uh, there are times where the material will be really, really rough. Um, this one is not as soft, but my boys don't seem to mind and they like it just fine. Uh, so just wanted to go ahead and show that to you because, um, I prefer an extremely squishy, nice and fluffy. My kids prefer something very, very flat and very lightweight. So that's the difference between the two. Uh, thanks for watching, guys, and y'all have a great day.